kingdom. This is hey, acrobat. Bro. When he talks, nobody can challenge him. A threat to the kingdom. My love. I have managed to get commitment statement from all the leaders of the women. I'm thinking you should do the same with the men. You know, once we get them committed to us, it will be very easy to bring that man down from his high horse. Listen, relax. I have fashioned out a different way to deal with that man. You know, he shot himself in the leg when he allowed me to go through the right traditional process of becoming king. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, Your Majesty, I am not sure I understand what you What I am trying to say is that Obuefi Agobanze can only back what he cannot buy. He cannot dethrone me, for I am king. The chief priest of Eno Avomi will not even listen to me. <sighs> My king, sometimes when you speak, it dawns on me that you do not know the extent that man can go. <laughs> he is a deadly politician, remember. And politicians can do very terrible things just to achieve their political objectives. Sometimes when you talk, it dawns on me that you do not know the extent your husband can go. I'm not a politician. I don't need to be a politician. From a king. I have chosen not to deal with him myself. I have chosen to allow the universe deal with him. Allow the universe deal with him? Again, she does not understand. Don't worry. When it begins to happen, I'll ensure that you get a front row seat to enjoy yourself. Daddy, I want to discuss something with you. Where is it? Betty! Goodness me! What are you doing on my father's bed? Betty, what is going on here? Betty, you're supposed to be my friend. Is this what's going on? Why are you bereft of courtesy? A graduate like you? You go budget to somebody's room without the courtesy of another mom, mom, mom. Are you sick or something? Yeah. I shouldn't be talking to you. Betty. You are supposed to be my friend. I should have known. I should have known. This closeness you have with my dad. I should have known. But, you know what? I detest you. And from this moment onward, you cease to be my friend. Okay. You know, I am actually excited, I must confess. I don't understand. Why will you be excited? Amanda, he, my daughter, your friend. It should be bothered that she caught us in the act. Oh, please. On the contrary, I am happy because I don't have to be scared to show off my man anymore. Who is your man? You, of course. What? Or do you have any other person that can do to you the things that I do to you the way that I do them? Listen to me, Betty. I am your boss. You should be able to know the difference between two of them. Amanda, please, I can explain this. You can? What exactly? 
that you have the infantry to sleep with my father right under my nose. And then you come with me with some stupid explanations. Really? Let me ask. How long has this been going on for? You are my good friend. But there are some certain things that you will not understand. Your father has been so nice to me. He has helped me business-wise. If he wants to have a taste of me, why would I say no? Wouldn't it be so ridiculous and silly for me to say that? That's nonsense. You are speaking arrant nonsense. You know, all this while, I've been thinking that you've been hanging around here because of me. But now that we both know that I've been wrong this whole time, do you have the decency of telling me how long this has been going on for? You know, it seems you've not been listening to me all this while. Young woman, I just said that your father has been so nice to me. He made me stand my ground, business-wise and otherwise. Oh, he has helped you stand your ground in your business. Bravo. So, opening your cheek self to him mm. is the only way you can I know I'm not ashamed that can sort from you. You hooligan from the pit of hell, don't you dare. What is this? You know what, it's not even your fault. I blame your father. He made everything at your back and call so easy for you. You should go out there, walk your ass out like a woman, be your own boss lady. Maybe that's where you will stop prognosing on who your father sleeps with and who he doesn't sleep with. You will not fit! The next time you will try to raise your shredded light canes on me again, I would cut it to bits and feed it to the shark in the ocean of maritals. Scalawag. What was that? I was hearing voices. Were you quarreling with Betty or something? You know you've not changed at all. How do you mean? You are still the old you. No wonder she was always supporting you. You better achieve everything she wanted to achieve. Father, if you really wanted to be married, why did you go looking for someone else? Why did you not go looking for a more decent woman? I love it. Yes, I love her because she has what many women do not have. Oh, yes. She is very decent to me. And if she is ready, I will make her my wife. You love her? Yes. Well, she doesn't love you. She's with you for the gains, for the benefits. Why can't you see that? No, you are wrong. She makes me very happy. And I'm telling you, doing the things I do with her and the things I do for her is equally my own way of making her happy. You should be able to understand that. That's exactly what killed my mother. The promiscuity and evil doings. I was what killed my mother. How dare you? We are talking here and you are making reference to that beautiful woman I married. Let this be the very last time you will ever bring my wife into our discussion. Don't try it again. That beautiful woman that you just described her should be turning in her grave right now, knowing that she died for nothing. Go ahead. Be it Betsy or any other woman that pleases you. Marry them all, Daddy. I don't care. Not anymore. I slapped you before. Nice to hit you. Hello. 
lot of things went through my mind when I was told that you'd like to see me as a mom. However, I decided to fast track your appointment uh, so that we can sit down and talk as there are a few things I'd like to discuss with you. Well, I don't know the things you plan to discuss with me. But I must let you know that you are now the envy of many. Definitely you will have enemies. You will have those who want you to succeed. You will also have those who do not want you to reign long. I am sure you know a few things about the staff of the kings with you. Everything you need as a king is in that staff. I've been asking a lot of questions, as a one that includes me traveling all the way to consult his Akajo for you, of a do every kingdom. And you see everything that you have said here is exactly what he told me about the staff. That staff is capable of averting any disaster. It is also capable of revealing so many evils and giving remedy to them. If finally you are pushed to the wall, use that staff. Ah! Is <laughs> Akaji of evil, man of truth. <laughs> Almost as if the both of you you know, <laughs> met and discussed this issue because uh, you speak the same language. Huh? Not only are you telling me the truth, but um, I can see that you're also here because you see evil coming. Am I right? And that is why you are planted as the king to ward off evil. Do not relent. For there is a reason why the gods allowed you to become king. You cannot afford to disappoint them. Thank you very much. I assure you today that I will not disappoint you. Listen, Amanda. A man must do what he must do to protect himself from prostate cancer. And did you really know you're confusing me like right now? Yes. I am talking about my father. Insulting me by sleeping with my friend and you here talking about prostate cancer. Well, good news is there is nothing of such in my lineage. And if care is not taken, you are going to drive my brother into becoming one. To the best of my knowledge, my brother didn't rape that friend of yours. What I had was a matured relationship between two mature people. This shouldn't even come up for discussion, please. Madam Okoyego, should I take this to be as um, a sister who is here to support her brother, rather than one who has come to call her brother to order. Prove me wrong. Isn't that why you're here, to support your brother? On the issue of destabilizing the kingdom, why not? I will call my brother to order. Okay. But on the reports that he slept with your friend, like I said, he shouldn't even come for discussion. All I'm expecting is for you to force your friend to marry my brother. Never. My father will never marry Betty. A loser, classless girl. Betty classless. Yes. Do you even know the meaning of being classless? Obviously you don't know. Because she owns the best marble company in this town. Yes. Because my father made it possible. And to, listen to me, my father is not going to marry Betty. That she succeeded in conjuring him into doing all that does not mean anything. Just let this lie. Please, you will talk like a child. See, 
You don't need to hate her. What you need to do is to bring her close. She is already an asset. And we need her for a lot of things. Think. What is it? What is it? Take a look at it. What? What is the meaning of this? Politics. The man you are waiting for the universe to deal with is already using empirical weapons to deal with you. So this man went ahead to publish this. To achieve what exactly? Do you know how many calls I have received today? Huh? This man is no longer sleeping. He is working tirelessly day and night to bring you down. Listen. Alan. Sit. Where have you been, Gwebelunoji? The chief priest of Enuavo Meme Kingdom visited me today. I was told. But what has that got to do with anything? Oh, it has everything to do with this. I want you to relax. Do not get yourself worked up over this. My king, I cannot relax. Do you know how many people he has gotten to sign the papers already? By noon, over 2,000 people must have signed those papers. Let them sign all the papers they want to sign. But the staff of kings remains with me, the king. Auntie, I can bet you with everything I hold there that my father is responsible for this. I know him. He is the brain behind this. You planted someone on the throne. Let that someone rule now. Is that a problem? What exactly is his problem? Oh my God. The problem I'm having is <sighs> that he is not even picking up his call. Hmm? And there is nothing I can do if he did not pick his call. Okay. Please, Auntie. Today is not one of those days that you run back to your husband's house. If there's any virtue left in my father, I know he's returning home after all the rubbish he does outside. So he must come back. I know he will. So please stay back and have a meeting with him. I'm begging you. Because that man is becoming a joke in this community. He does not even know it. Amanda, I never told you that I'm leaving today. Better. Because right before he became my father, he was originally your brother. So please, you need to call him to order. Call my father to order. Because it is becoming... I don't understand. Amanda. Ma? Remember that you did not send for me. I came here on my own. Yeah. I will not leave until we achieve something. That sounds so nice. We really have to achieve something. Auntie, I have a meeting at the palace. I will see you when I return. Good for you. Yes, good for us. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, excuse your rudeness. And we are home. The problem of a kingdom is it when he talks, nobody can challenge him. Betrayed to the kingdom, is it he portrays himself as a demigod. Oh, Yes, I 
an evil man And he fears no one Call himself a godfather Oppressing the people Everyone is scared of him At the nation of Islam Everybody scamper Because he is an evil man Trade to the kingdom A trade to the kingdom it's the problem of a kingdom He says, hey, when he talks, nobody can challenge He's a threat to the kingdom He portrays himself as a demigod Many of the people that signed it signed the He's a threat to the kingdom They still sign, I see this Talks, nobody can challenge. He's an evil man. Just and let them say he's no one. Call he's himself a godfather, oppressing the people. One of Everyone is scared of him. him. At the mention of Christmas. Islam, everybody is back because he is, is an evil man. Allow me to trade to the kingdom. A trade right? to the kingdom He's the problem of a kingdom When he talks nobody can challenge A trade to the kingdom He portray himself as a demigod A trade to the kingdom I can tell you I'll cover the 5,000 speeches. In fact, I'll raise to 10,000. Now we are talking. <laughs> get out to get out to in the middle. Yes, yes. everything okay you don't sound like you know me i'm here to see the queen i've been here before of course i know who you are i know this face the face that is the offspring of a man whose heart is dark man who has turned our kingdom upside down. I know this face. The face that came straight from the loins of a man who has made my reign. Frustrating and difficult. And you stand in front of me to ask me if everything is alright. And so I ask you, did your father send you to me? I am not my father. And I am nothing like my father. Permit me to say, Your Majesty, that probably you were too hungry for power that you did not take a second to investigate the man you trusted and chose as a godfather. He thought he was going to help you. Huh? And sir, in your wisdom, what do you advise? Now, that your father has seen that I am not going to play ball, that I am not willing to loot this kingdom down. What do you advise? That I step down the skin? Ask about me, Your Majesty. They will tell you that I am in no way like my father. Your wife even can tell you that. And now that you asked, in my wisdom, I think you're doing very well. Yes. So whatever it is that you are doing, please keep doing it. And I tell you, my father 
I repeat, my father cannot bring you down. <laughs> Are you sure? Trust me. That you're your father's daughter. <laughs> I am. You may sit. Thank you. Oh, welcome, my sister. You are married to a man of Akiji, who, to the best of my knowledge, is doing so well in business, and who has no business with what we do in the politics of our new form. Why are you so delayed back here? You know, in poking your nose into the things we are doing in our kingdom. Why? What do you mean? Do you mean that because I'm married to another town, that I do not have the right to be involved in what happens in my own kingdom? Okay, okay. Okwego, let us not misunderstand ourselves. You may decide to get involved with what happens in Enuavon because this is your town. No problem. But can you at least... Can you stay away from the things I am doing? Can you? Huh. What you are doing is the reason why I am here. The people are complaining. Which people? Our people, of course. They say that you are destabilizing the kingdom. And I feel, as a sister, that you should not be involved in something like well, this. Okay, well, okay, okay, let me just say this because you are deviating. The process of change brought this boy into kingship because if not for change that boy wouldn't have become king in the first place and now that he has changed into something that i cannot understand another process of change must be smuggled in to see him out do you have a problem with that no do you have a problem with that Since, uh... Mua, yes that is me Can I at least ask you a question? No! What you need to do is to go back to your husband. You don't need to ask me any question because I'm not going to answer. Your loggerhead with my father because he refused to do his business. I understand. My father has adjudged this kingdom for a very long time. And that was why he took an active part in choosing who the king will be. And that happens to be you. Guess he thought you were one of those people that he could manipulate. He was wrong. I see. I have made up my mind on how I want to deal with this issue. Therefore, I will no longer join issues with your father. Okay. I don't know how you plan on dealing with the issue, like you said, but please, I would advise you apply so much wisdom. And by that, you mean what exactly? He's my father. I have known him all my life. Do not go to him as an enemy. You won't like him. Yes. He has no conscience. None at all. You know, I'm still taking aback by your declarations here. Because to the best of my knowledge, this man, Agobadze, is still your father. You still live under his roof. Why do you talk about him like this? And why have you chosen to take this position? Have I said a lie about my father? Do you not agree with me that everything I have said here is the truth? Your Majesty, what I need is a kingdom that works for all. Not one that is being hijacked by a selected selfish few. I hate to see people live in fear. He may be my father, but I, I am cut from a different cloth. When the killer kills, they just will done. They just want to observe if the killer. 
you know, Amanda, I am really interested in knowing exactly what you were discussing with my husband. Nothing really, my friend. He was trying to classify me alongside with my father. So I had to take some time to explain to him that I am nothing like my father. As at the time the meeting ended, I can tell you for a fact that we had an understanding. I see. You know, my husband has refused to engage your father. Mm -hmm. He has left him for the universe to handle his issue. And I think that is right. Yes, the universe is already handling my father. Because even the signatures they were securing to get the king dethroned has not worked out. Because something that they cannot even explain themselves has divided them. How do you know that? I am active here. I have my ears to the ground. Hmm. I see. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, it was nice having you around. I am pleased. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I will beg to leave now. All right, dear. Go well. Best of my knowledge, I've not seen these faces in this kingdom before. Well, sir, we are detectives from the police headquarters, and we have a warrant for your arrest, sir. This must be a joke, right? We are not joking here, Ichie. Please, you have to come with us to the station. In that case, you will allow me to go get my car key. Let me drive behind you guys. Sorry, no, sir. You have to come with us in our own vehicle. Do you understand what you're saying? No, no, no. Do you know the man you are talking to? This is this is Zagubaze of Inua Bomeme Kingdom. You can't be talking to me in this manner. Sir, we will appreciate it if you do not create a scene. Can we go, sir? Your Majesty, I am highly elated. The news is everywhere in the kingdom that Zagubaze has been arrested. <laughs> A tray to the kingdom It's the problem of our kingdom hey. When he talks nobody can challenge A tray to the kingdom He portray himself as a demigod A tray to the kingdom Nobody can challenge He's an evil man And he fears no one Call himself a godfather Oppressing the people Everyone is scared of him At the mention of his name Everybody scamper Because he is an evil man Straight to the kingdom a trade to the kingdom He's the problem of our kingdom hey. When he talks nobody can challenge A trade to the kingdom He portray himself as a demigod A trade to the kingdom Nobody can challenge He's an evil man And he fears no one Call himself a godfather Oppressing the people Everyone is scared of him At the mention of his name Everybody scamper Because he is an evil man Trade to the kingdom a trade to the kingdom He's the problem of our kingdom hey. When he talks